Hello everyone and welcome back to Wicked Art. It's Wicked here and this is another Tiny Tuesday, our second one. All you're going to need is an eraser and a pencil of some kind. Doesn't matter which, as long as you have two. Okay, so today for Tiny Tuesday we're going to draw a little tiny Batman. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to lightly, don't press down the heart, lightly draw ourselves a circle okay and remember pause the video if you need to okay so first thing I want you to do start here at the top and I want you to curve so not straight you're gonna curve a line just past your circle like that okay and the next thing I want you to do is we're going to come right here in this bottom part of the circle. Okay. I want you to go like this and make a little rainbow curve like that. And then I want you to curve. So it's almost like we're making a rainbow on its side. Then I want you to make another curve like this. Okay. So we're going to switch to the other side over here and we're going to draw a straight line that comes down this way. And then we're going to come down at an angle and meet it right here. you to come right here where you made your curve okay we're gonna go like this and go down towards the middle at an angle like that okay and it's almost like we're making a, a, a rectangle so you're gonna draw a little line like this and then you're gonna curve back up just like that switch to the other side right here we're going to go back just like this make a line and we're going to do the same thing we're going to go down at an angle okay and then you're going to go back like this and then just curve it to make that shape right there erase these lines in the middle and this line on the outside right here okay now I want you to come to this line out here right here on the corner and you're gonna go straight back like that the top and then we're going to curve along the line okay now I want you to take a line see how I start down here we're going to go up this way like that okay once we do that we're going to come down and stop about right there this line up to here it should look like that then we're going to come out here and erase all of the sketchiness on the outside just like that okay now we're going to come up here to the top of the head and we're going to come down just a little we're going to angle back like that stop and then we're going to angle down like that okay then I want 
want you to come down here in between the two eyes. We're going to arch this way. And then you're going to arch that way. Okay, so now we got a little Batman head going. I'm going to come to this point. I'm going to come down a little bit. I'm going to turn out this way with an arch. And then we're going to arch back this way. So we have ourselves a little face, and then we'll put another arch right underneath it. Okay. Now, now that we have that, we're going to come right here where the chin is. We're going to come up just a little bit, and we're going to make this line come down. And then we're going to stretch it like that. Okay. We're going to come behind the head over here, and we're going to go like this, and arch down this way, and just connect our two lines, just like that, okay? Now, we're going to come right here, back to this corner, and you're going to arch this way, and then go down that way. over to this side, okay, we're going to come right here, so see where the corner is, we're going to come down, we're going to go like this, we're going to come down at an angle, and then come back, like this, okay, then we're going to come right here and put a little mark, and we're going to go out, and curve down like this. Okay? Start where you left off. You're going to come up at an angle. And then you're going to go this way at an angle. Okay? Then from there, we're going to start right where we left off. We're going to go up. Come right. 
right here in the middle where a curve is and you're going to make a tiny line like this and then we're going to make another rectangle like that but this time we're going to come to the bottom and curve this way then we're going to curve back this way and then we'll curve down like that come back to this corner right here I want you to go up just a little and then I want you to curve up that way just like that Okay. now we're going to put a little line right here on this finger And then we're going to come back over here to this side. Okay, so let's come right here on this corner, right here. Okay, we're going to go up this way. Then we're going to go out that way. Okay, we're going to curve or just draw a straight line going up like that. See, it's really tiny. Okay, then I want you to go like this. I want you to curve it all the way back like that okay and we're going to make a little adjustment after this so I want you to draw a straight line going up like that okay then we're going to cut right in front and curve right there okay then we can erase this little line that we have left over on the outside thing I want you to do is we're going to come right here to this line right here and we're going to go out this way so just come straight out I want you to curve down this way come straight across just like that and then come back like that okay then we're going to come right back here to this corner where these two lines touch. You're going to go out this way. Okay. Then we're going to curve like that and connect it to. Alright. Come back over here to this corner right here. I want you to curve that. Okay. Come back to this line right here. And then I want you to go down and curve back. Okay. And then I want you to go straight out and then curve towards the thumb. Then we'll do one more. You're going to come right back here to this corner going to go down just a little and then curve to the thumb okay so we need to come back up this way all right we're going to come right here to this corner and move up just a little and we're going to put a little curve right here okay and then we're going to do a bigger curve like that then we're going to switch. We're going to come right here. So if you want to start here and come down just a little, we're going to go out that way. And then we're going to go that way. Okay, so we're just curving out. Now you're going to start here. You're going to curve all the way back. And then go that way. come back right here to this corner you're going to go up just a little bit and we're going to go out like that and then come back down to this side so we're going to come out right here and then go back like that and we want to put a little curve right there Okay. Now come back down where you 
start at the curve right here. We're going to curve out like that. Then we're going to go put a little line right there. And go forward. And curve. And then turn right there. Okay. Now let's come back up here to this line. Right. Remember, pause the video if you need to. So we're going to come back to this line here. We're going to go out that way, like that. And then we're going to go down. Okay. And then we'll go up. And then down one more time. Right. So now I want you to curve in like that. And then curve down. And then we're going to go out. Just like that. So see how it makes this kind of like a V shape. Okay, and then we're going to curve out this way. And then right where we left off, we're going to curve that way. Like that. Okay. Now come back down here. I want you to curve up a little mountain and we're going to curve this way and make another mountain just like that okay then we're going to curve back we're going to go up and make a point and then all you have to do is curve back and connect so now it looks like he has a little battering okay now, let's come back over to this side of the arm right here. We're almost done. Okay. So right here, where we have this little curve, I want you to go out this way. Okay. And I want you to curve down that way. Right. Then, we're going to kind of come back a little bit and cut in front of that line this little mountain shape like that and we're going to go back in an angle this way and make a line like that okay so it kind of looks like a very sharp pointed C All right then we're going to come back to our point here okay we're going to curve like that then we're going to come to this point don't want to touch it so just move out just a little bit and then we're going to curve back just like that okay now before we do anything else we're going to add two rectangles we're going to come up here to the top and add a rectangle like that and move down just a little bit and add another rectangle like that so let's erase anything that's inside of that rectangle. Okay. Now, I want you to take this line right here and just continue to curve it until it touches. Okay. Now, next thing we're going to do is come to this knee right here. Okay. We're going to curve down like that. Follow that 
same shape to here. So what I got to do is just come right here, go up and go over. Okay, then we're going to come down this way and stop like that. Then I want you to curve in front of it. Okay, and then all you have to do is swing up. Okay, and stop right there, and then connect it like that. So we can erase this little line in the middle and then come right here to this corner and go like this and put a little arch there. Okay. Now I come down here to the cape at the bottom on the corner and I want you to put an arch and then we're going to come right here and we're going to draw a line down it and we're going to put an arch like that. Okay. Then we're going to come underneath the arm right here and we're going to curve down like that. And then we're going to put another line right here. Okay. Then we're going to come down here to this side of the knee. We're going to curve down. Out, and then go up like that. And we're going to draw a line back to the leg. Okay. Then come down here and move forward and curve. So see, you're just going to do a big curve just like that. Then we're going to curve up. up that way. Then we're going to swing down. Make a turn like this. And again, that's just going to run right next to the edge here. Okay. And then a couple more lines. We're going to come here next to the shoe and make a curve. I want you to come back here and curve that way and then come back here on this side and curve that way okay so next let's come back up here to the ear we're almost done right in the corner we're going to draw a straight line down and then curve it this way okay and then I'm going to connect that to the eyes, just like that. And now let's connect this to the eye right here. Okay. And then we just got to draw a little bat symbol in here. Okay. So right here where this corner is down here, we're going to make a U shape like that. Okay. So you're going to come to the top of the U right here and come down like that. And come to the other side and come down like this. Okay. Then we're going to curve back and then make a sharp point and curve that back like that. Then come on this side. We're going to curve back down like that. Come to this side, on the other side of the arm here. Okay. I'm going to go like this and make an arch. Go down and up. Go down and up. And then make a long one that comes like that. Okay. And that is our little Batman for Tiny Tuesday. I hope it wasn't too difficult. If it was, let me know in the comments. I can knock it back down to more simpler shapes next time. But I thought I'd push it a little bit and see how far you can take it. Other than that, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you had fun. If you like what you're seeing, subscribe to the channel. Uh, leave a like. 
comment. If not, and you just had fun, that's fine too. This is Wicked, and until next time, keep on sketching. Bye.